Hello, Ms. Brown, Brown Residence. How can I help you? Hello, Ms. Brown. This is uh, Principal Munseth from West. Uh, thanks so much for your message last night and your support for your daughter. Um, I also just wanted to thank you for the um, call that you made to the school counselor. Just being able to uh, hear that in your message uh, just shows that you really want to make sure you get some answers here and uh, find out a little bit more about what happened with this year's MCA assessments. Oh, thank you for calling. I'm glad you made this a priority in your day. You know, Ashley's education is very important to us, and I, I really got to get this figured out. Yeah, and from your voice message, um, I just want to make sure I've heard your concern correctly. Um, according to the seventh grade, seventh grade scores, um, Ashley's test scores in her math class don't really seem to connect with this most recent uh, assessment. Is that correct? Yes, I, I don't understand how she can get straight A's in class and then a, a two on the MCA. I mean, in addition, her math test results have been quite good. I, I mean, what's happening in class? I, I'm... I just don't understand this issue with the alignment. Yeah, I, I hear your concern. Uh, I mean, with the 97 percent percentile in all of her scores in her algebra class, uh, she has done quite well. Um, but I also want you to know that uh, Hopkins is committed to making sure that we align everything that we do with the state, um, and also that MCA tests change from year to year. Um, we want to make sure we're ensuring fidelity, making sure that we're not just having the same questions and. Um, I know your daughter, Ashley, um, just her love for school, her love for sports. Um, teachers continue to share her stellar work ethic, too. Um, and I have confidence that your daughter's uh, given past performance, um, that she will excel. Um, however, as a staff, we will continue to monitor her work just to make sure that she is uh, not missing anything that could come up in next year's assessments. Well, <clears throat> does she need remediation? I mean, if so, what, what kind? I guess I'm not really sure where to go with that. You know... What we do as a family, um, we want to make sure she's able to participate in her sports. She's really good. She enjoys it. Um, but we, it won't be in place of academic achievement. We just won't do that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of great programs out there. But at this point, I guess, Ms. Brown, I don't foresee an immediate need for remediation. Um, Ashley, Ashley's scores on this test, yes, they are lower than past assessments, but she should go ahead and enjoy her summer sports. Uh, meanwhile, this is the exact information our teachers use to prepare for Ashley's 8th grade year. Uh, teachers and leadership at West are constantly in conversation about alignment with state standards. Um, our goal is to make sure your daughter has what she needs to reach that next level. Um, and with her strong work ethic and high achievement in all academic areas, Ashley's potential is high. Well, I'm glad to relieve, or I'm very relieved to know that you and teachers use this information in a proactive way. You know, I would never have gathered that from what your counselor said. Um, that's not the message I got. And I would hate to see Ashley miss out on any learning opportunities that would make her successful in the MCA. It's not, she doesn't want to have um, low test scores. Yeah, I, I, I hear that concern and I heard that in your message and I apologize for this confusion uh, we have created. And I, will, I have a scheduled conversation to have with the counselor. Uh, we put a lot of emphasis on these state assessments and our message should be clear uh, to parents. So, thank you. Well, good. I'm, I'm glad to know that. I just, I just want to know that everybody's on the same page, including me. Mm -hmm. well, Ms. Brown, I appreciate your attention to these recent scores, and uh, just want you to know that we're watching Ashley as well. Um, working with you in the upcoming years, I hope you'll know that uh, we'll be continuing to communicate. Um, if Ashley's adamant about doing something this, this summer, um, there are some programs available that wouldn't ha hamper her active schedule. Are you uh, interested in hearing about some of those? or? Well, yeah, I... I it might not be a bad idea for her to do a little bit of work over the summer so she doesn't, you know, lose any ground. But I do appreciate that you called and took time to talk to me and that I don't have to, I guess I'm going to take away from this that I'm not going to really have to worry and that what she's getting in class is what she needs. Yeah. yeah. I'll put together an uh, email, just uh, some different links to sources and uh, also just, you know, if there's anything else that I can do, um, respond to that email, call again. Uh, we'll keep working to make sure that Ashley has exactly what she needs in the Hopkins School District. So thank you again, Ms. Brown. Thank you. I appreciate it.